Hey everyone, this is D from AALD, and today I'm going to show you guys a simple tip called aliases. This might save you a lot of time while modeling in Rhino. So you're probably thinking right now, what are aliases? So aliases are Rhino custom shortcuts for commands. Instead of typing out a long command or navigating menus, you can assign quick memorable shortcuts to frequently used tools, for example polyline, boolean union, rectangle, etc. So what you want to do is first go to tools and go down to options and open the menu. And on the left hand side you can see aliases. And here it shows the current Rhino default assigned aliases and their commands. In this example, we are drawing a rectangle using a polyline tool. As you can see, typing out the full command might take an extra 2-3 to three seconds out from your workflow. We can simplify the whole process by setting a short abbreviation for these commands. For example, PL for polyline. In this case, I prefer using Q as it is more convenient for me. Over here, I'm just setting up some of my own preferred aliases. For example, BU for Boolean Union, REC for Rectangle, and E for Extrude Curve, and so on. The key of choosing aliases is that it should feel intuitive and streamlined for your workflow. So just pick whatever you feel like is working for you. For people who are used to AutoCAD, I will attach a McNeil form where they have provided a standard set of AutoCAD aliases that you can import into Rhino. Now let's test out these aliases and see how it can improve the workflow. In the first attempt, I typed out all the commands and I did not use any aliases. And you can see this led to a very slow result. On the second attempt, we can see a much faster workflow. By using aliases, it made my work faster by 15 seconds. Aliases are simple ways to take your Rhino skills to the next level. Hopefully this video can make you finish your models faster for the future.